Okay. That's not what's going on anymore, but got a little itch. I had to scratch. So this is going to be just for fun. I will not say anything more about it. Let's just crank it open, see what happens here. This is a $50, $50 pack. <laughs> slab pack. Pokemon. Four slabs. Let's see what we get in here. Something good, I hope. Geodude. It's kind of funny how people grade certain cars, you know, like why it doesn't seem like why you would want to, you know, this is just a legend make a reverse hollow 2006, I think it said. Yeah, 2006 Pokemon EX. Maybe if I saw it in person, it probably look a lot nicer. It's probably a hollow so it should should look pretty good but yeah, the picture here just yeah looks like a regular roll card oh clear uh, i can't say the name right clefairy this gets pretty high scores at least on these 9.5 2016 pokemon xy i don't play pokemon so I couldn't tell you much about the characters, of course. Evolution's hollow. Colossal. Now, I don't know if it does something special if you like, get a chase card or something. I don't know if I'm saying none of these are, but I don't know if it's going to go oh, and flash and do something, but it's pretty cool. Darkness of Blaze. That must be the series it comes from. Again, I don't know much about Pokemon, so... And that is a 2020 Pokemon SWSH, whatever that stands for. And I guess our last card coming up. What was that, a 10? Or, yeah, that's a 10. I saw a 9.5 in there. Ditto. From 2023 Pokemon SWSH must be the, the series. I don't know all the series, but I'm, I'm assuming it's a series. Crowned it Zenith. All right, well that's it. So my, uh, I'm uh, <laughs> putting a bunch of stuff in my showroom here. Fourteen cars today. Now from here, I don't know. These are real cards, as far as I'm, as far as I know. So they're not EFTs. I assume you can pull these out. You probably have to pay some more money for shipping or something or whatever. You can also uh, list them up here for, uh, you know for sale, for trade, or whatever. <laughs> so, it's pretty cool. It may be a lot cooler if it hits something, of course, but, you know. It's not a huge, not a huge, huge gamble, but, I mean, it's 50 bucks for, you know, for something I don't even know. You know, I don't even know the prices on these. This could be $10 worth of cards, as far as I know, $5 worth. You know, same with this. I would say this goose card might be worth a little bit, but there's no uh, no data. Like I said, again, you can go into it. Let's, let's go into one of these. Maybe maybe this has some. This is not listed, so yeah. So there's no sales data available for this card. Uh, they all say not listed, so I guess there's no data for any of them. <laughs> well, actually, this is this is up there. Um, yeah, I don't think it's $356. <laughs> that would be nice. It was 500 No way. Just check eBay comp. So let's just go through it all here. I don't know. Yeah, it's more like it. Uh, there we go. 2016, $24. So what in the, well, no, that's not the card. What's the card we're looking at? Yeah, Clefairy. Uh, card number 63. Where did you, you get these prices from? That's crazy. Go Fairy 2016. That's right here. $24.42. <laughs> That's a 10. That's a 10 in uh, CGC. Take out my hopes up, man. I'm saying $300. I'm like, holy crap. 
Why is it? Oh, so, probably the 108 card set. It's not numbered 63 out of. Oh, that one sold for $2.95. There you go. Raw. This is a PSA 9 for 12. So I would say it's a $15, $20 card max. How? Wow. What? How do they come up with uh, three hundred and fifty-six dollars? Uh, that's a little misleading. <laughs> I was like, "Wow, um, uh, that's awesome!" So you can't really even you can't really look at these things. This one might be more realistic, twenty-five dollars, but that's still probably high. Let's see if we can pick up anything. Well, no, one sold for seventy. PSA ten. Full art ditto crown of zenith. This is shown as being an ultra rare. Of course, who knows what it really is. This is a AGS nine. What is it? AGS? Never heard of that before. That's only five bucks. Pre orders of ten, eighty bucks. A nine for thirty. Nine for nineteen. So that one's a. That one's a little bit more decent, even though here it's showing 2520. What well, is this? A PSA 10? Not is it? Not a uh, not an arena club. So that's cool. This, this, these comps are a little bit closer to reality here. So, but as you see, it's falling off. So, but you know, you got all four of them for 50 bucks. <laughs> What's the other card here? This guy. No sales data. I wonder if he still picks up stuff. Yeah, five, six bucks. What is it? Those are sevens. Fifty-four here for uh, CGC ten for Steam. PSA nine for ten fifty. And what is this one? It's Arena Club nine. So. All right, just showing you, show me this stuff here. I don't think, what? Oh, these, what? Oh, this Pac-Man showroom. Right. They got Derek Jeter. I think he runs, I think he's the one that runs Arena Club. Steve Nash, et cetera, et cetera. Where's mine? Where, I don't want to go to somebody else's. I want to go to mine. <laughs> hmm. Well, that's interesting. I guess I could go over here somewhere. There you go. My showroom. The Pokemon crew. Let's check some of these real quick. Since I'm here. No sales data. Yeah, we're talking $3 card. $10, you know, graded, I guess. $12 for a PSA 8. Definitely not a... A card, you know, it's just a regular old mosaic, green mosaic, not numbered. Uh, so, yeah, it's kind of what I expected. But did we check this right? No sales data, but I didn't do this part, though. No. Maybe, maybe you can get something out of it. Best offer accepted on a 45, 850. 750, these are non graded. This is raw. Seventeen fifty. I don't see any graded. Probably the biggest card there, though. Seventy bucks for a PSA ten. Yes, around seventy bucks for a PSA ten. What was a PSA ten went for forty five? Well, actually, cheaper than that, maybe. It's crossed out, so I think it was like a best offer. Best offer accepted. Yeah. Nine for twenty. What is this one? The ten. I mean, that's good. 
maybe 50 bucks. I guess I'm just guessing. So, any uh, Cowboys fans out there? Actually, I have an idea what to do with that one. This can't be much. If he even finds it anywhere, yeah, it doesn't even find it. 2015. Numbered out of 99. It's a Herbert. Herbert 10. These are probably about right. Probably 20, 30 bucks. This is absolute. <laughs> it's a 10, right? So 35. That was a, well, that was uh, yesterday. Yeah, like I said, about 30 bucks. For a slab. I think it was up to 51. It had to be up above, yeah, 100. It's a two month. $164. Wow. I probably know what to do with that card too. If I were to pull them, which is something else, I guess you gotta figure out how to do. Do we get to, uh, as this thing says, minting in progress? I'm gonna have to figure out what all this stuff means. The minting in progress. I mean, it's a, it's a card already. What, what are they minting? They're making a new one? <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> or is it probably, it's probably just like, uh, the, uh, what they have to do in the background or something. Yes, this is minting in progress. All the paperwork on the back end. This is raw. 60 or best offer. Best offer was accepted. 1650 raw. Uh, PSA 9, 26 dollars. Oh yeah, another ten twenty dollar card. Twenty, I'd say twenty. Probably, probably a solid twenty. As a PSA, or, or what is it? It's a, a PSA eight, actually. So, yeah, fifteen dollars or something. <laughs> I'll push it off as a ten. <laughs> no, just just joking. Ask me what the PSA grade is. I say it's a 10. It says right there. It was an automatic 10. That has nothing to do with the automatic. Oh, the autograph. And a couple baseball. Uh, the reason I bought the baseball in the first place is I couldn't get into the uh, couldn't get into the fifty dollar football. It would never let me in. So uh, the football. These are hundred dollar packs. So the only fifty dollars packs I could get into were Pokemon and baseball. I tried to get into football, but didn't work out. All right, that's gonna do it for Arena Club slap packs. Take three. <laughs>